And speaking of big plans, we had a chance to find out about a new team that's formed. The Indianapolis Junior Roller Derby League is for girls as young as seven years old, and we made it up to Indy to find out more as they gear up for their first bout. Tough, sporty divas. These are words that describe the girls of roller derby. And the same goes for members of the increasingly popular Junior League players, meeting twice a week in this warehouse. The Indianapolis Junior Roller Derby League now has 28 active members. I chose roller derby because my cousin was doing it. It was a really interesting sport at the time. I'd never heard of it, but everyone got to wear the cool clothing, got to wear some cool tights, and uh, got to look all punky and bruisey. <laughs> fun to be a princess on skates. Roller girl Addie Tude says that this is the only activity that really made her feel at home. Well, I've played many sports. I've played, I went from gymna gymnastics to karate, to bait, to softball, to soccer, and, and derby is like, you know that sport that fits you, right? Well, that's what derby did to me. The sport itself helps the girls feel empowered. It helps you become a better skater, and it teaches it teaches me that everything is not everything is not about winning. Stay in your pack. Stay in your pack. Line up on the line. Sandy Nelson, one of the coaches for the Indianapolis Junior Roller Derby League and a former skater for the Naptown Roller Girls, feels roller derby changes outlooks and creates a welcoming environment. I believe with all my heart what I do makes a big difference in these girls' lives. Um, we have positive influence in all their lives. Uh, the girls come from backgrounds of not fitting in with your traditional sports that are offered through school, and uh, this is an outlet for them. I don't know. That looked like a tie. Most every parent is on board with the rough and tumble nature of this sport and say they don't have to push or prod to get their girls to practice. You're going to pair up and you're going to shoot the duck to the next pack. Oh. Where we don't know how. And it's a chance for girls to play a, a full contact sport, which they don't get to play in other mainstream sports, and they, they like it. There are a lot of girls really like it. While these junior players don't get the full-on rough play that the adult teams are infamous for, there's still plenty of bumps to be had. You ha there's rules like you cannot push someone on the back, you can't grab them or pull them, you can't grab each other's hair and throw them off the track like you've seen the big girls. Uh, we do really stress for the girls to be safe and not be silly, <laughs> and there are a lot of rules. Uh, we follow the rules really carefully because um, it's, a, it's a tough sport, and these girls need to know how to play a, a tough sport in a safe way, just so their bodies can last them for the rest of their life. They're so young, and they're still growing. To everyone involved, it comes down to one thing. Um, roller derby is a simple game, played with speed and played with a lot of, uh, a lot of power. It makes me feel excited and powerful. Learn more about the league and see a schedule of upcoming matches at IndianapolisJuniorDerby.com.